it's your boy Drop the Gamer here. Welcome you back to another special episode of the Saga Log. Honestly, we have some scary feats ahead of us, but you know, we gotta do what we gotta do, right? We have to do what we gotta do, okay? And I, I believe in us. I know we have the potential. It's whether or not we're gonna utilize that potential. And I gotta get some of my Pokemon back from the box because I trained up just an eedy weedy teeny weeny little bit okay just a little bit okay so it's fine okay we we got it we're gonna just withdraw the pokemon back out of the box also we found out that lampet has keen eye and honestly not a bad move set so Tarant, i see you buddy I see you, buddy. You're, you're gonna, you're, you're trying to be good, and I, I appreciate it. It's just, unfortunately, not really gonna work with this team. But yeah, little CB is actually named now. Thank God. Um, but yeah, we got the team up to level 19. No real changes at all, actually, that you didn't see already. Brittany tried to be a silly Willy Billy Goat again, and try and learn things that she really doesn't need. And I'm like, God, dang it, Brittany. Just freaking, it's fine. But Brittany did not listen. She wanted to be a butt. And it, you know, she just she wants to just be the, the water type. The water type. Not a water type. The water type. And that doesn't work with my team, honey. That's just that's just how it is. That how it do be. Okay, Brittany? Like I love you, but come on. Come on, girl. There's a bunch of things that we gotta go. The shop and no cancel. Hey, Big Dumb J, how are you? Oh my God, this is an acquaintance of yours. He's just dumb. Like, what the frick? And I'm like, I don't even know. Like, his team is just like, what? Oh, we gotta learn about Mega Evolution. No, no, we don't. There, there was a Mega Charizard just down the street. We can just catch that. Like, I, 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 I truly do not want to learn about Mega Evolution, honestly. Um, I just want to catch straight up Mega. That, that, that's just how I want to do things. I, it, it's just how this works. I, I get that, you know, I need to establish a bond between my Pokemon, but there's already a few Pokemon I've got a bond with, okay? So, like, do I really have to establish a bond if I already have a bond? Come this way on Route 7. Go to the berry fields and plant some berries. I mean, I will just to catch a Pokemon there, but, like, Oh my gosh, the Snorlax is sleeping. And you know what's fun about the Snorlax that's sleeping? You can't even catch it because it's not gonna be a static. Ha 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 ha, it's just a token encounter. I, 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 I don't care enough to even, I, I, the thing is I have to catch it for it to be a totem. Yeah, or a token, yeah, but like, mm. Can you go get this from Route 6? Sure, we're just not gonna fight anybody though. That's how we're going to do this, because I am just too scared to fight anybody. Uh, da, 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 da. I just realized I could have gotten my encounter and I would have been mad. Parfum Palace. Okay. We don't care. We can't get an encounter here. Uh Oh, do we have to fight? No, we don't. Okay, we don't. We can we can skip that. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Our encounter on Route 6 is a drum roll, please. You know, it's risky, Rufflet. It's risky. No, I can't be mad about that. I don't know why we're leading with butt poke. But, you know, I guess we decided that's what we wanted to do for some reason that day. Or, like, today. But that's not what we're doing in the end game here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and lead with Brittany. Or have Brittany out still. Because Brittany still does, I believe, the least amount of damage. 34... Uh, butt poke does the least amount of damage, but butt poke literally can't survive a thing. Bad touch would actually do the least amount of damage. Because pound is also 40. And you can glare. Yeah, bad touch is actually better. Okay. Because you have status here. Brittany does not. So bad touch is the better play. Ooh. We're just going to copy each other's glare it looks like oh pack oh, that's nothing 
That ain't a problem. Get paralyzed. Okay. So a pound does the least amount of damage. And I'm going to go for it. I don't see why not. I don't think it's going to kill. It's a... Yeah, not at all. Okay, we're fine. We can actually hit it again with, that, with no crit risk. So we'll do that now. Actually, there was crit risk there. We we lo we low high rolled, which I hate doing. Game, by the way, can we not? But I guess if we if you want to game, but like I don't really, I, I prefer not to have to worry about that low, low to high roll when I'm catching Pokemon. Tech and mirror move, huh? Those are two moves I don't necessarily like seeing. It's two moves I will live with. Doesn't mean that I have to love it. But we got Risky, so we're going to name it Risky. Risky Rufflet is on, not on the squad, but on the team, so that's good. Lil CB out here just being God as it always wants to be. Like, little CB just is like, um, don't worry, guys. I'm just gonna be a god today. And I'm just like, okay, little CB. Y you do you, buddy. Risky. R-U-F-F-L-E-T. Oh, my God. I can actually fit it. So, you guys know who I'm talking about. Risky Rufflet on the squad. I don't know what t what it has. Unfortunately, we won't be able to do that until Generation uh, 7, where we can just pop up and be like, Hi, what ability do you have? Let me know. It's time to, like, play now. Uh, oh, sh shoot. I decided to save my money like a freaking dumb. Uh I could go back, but I'm too far gone. I literally... I should have bought the Pokeballs. The fee will be $1,000 per person. That's how the rich gets richer. Here's your interest fee, $1,000. Oh my gosh. Why? I never... You don't even have $1,000. Wait. Did I actually not do it? Um... Oh no, I bought Great Balls! Let's go! I actually did the thing. That I did it the right way, but I questioned myself and have no self-esteem and confidence. That's 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 also sad, but also fine. You know, I, I yeah. Oh my god. Okay. We're fine. We're okay. This is gonna be easy. I I I straight up thought I was just dumb. Like honestly, I just always think that to be honest i need to get i get it's all that's self-improvement things i need to work on but also still it's just like did i actually do the stupid and it's like no no john you didn't actually do the stupid because you did you did the smart thing you just question yourself every chance you get which doesn't help you in the long run but gosh i actually this i'll have a look in the back I, I know, I, I know Mega. It's, it's the Mega episode. But, like, it's not really going to be too much of a Mega episode because, unfortunately for y'all, I actually know this puzzle as I'm going the wrong way. But I know I'm going the wrong way. I just want to get this guard specs that gives me $275. <laughs> I literally... That, that's so sad. Okay, that's one of the saddest things. I, I This will be fixed in, in Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, though. Um, in Gen 7, I should say. Because, yeah, it's really funny, like, how I fixed, how I figured it out. But it just was like, wow, that should not have taken me as long as it did to get that. Hi, Mega. Please don't run away. Oh, my God, Big Dumb J, you gotta give me a hand. We will. Okay, fine. Uh, I'm gonna chase the fur fruit. Pick a spot for me to stand. We gotta work together. Okay, you stand here. Stand here. 
No. Wait here. I, I drag the fur fruit up. We're getting closer. Oh my gosh. I know this. It's almost like I'm not Ryan and know where I'm going with this puzzle. Although it's probably for content. Honestly, I've been watching a, lot, a little bit more Pokemon content and it's funny to see kind of what people do for content, right? Because in my opinion, I, in my look, when I look at things, I'm like, oh, well, I should probably like not do this thing. And I'm super lytical, 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 that's a word, analytical, and look at things at like a different perspective. And I'm just like, um, well, well, why'd you do that? That makes no sense. And that, that, like, content is supposed to be fun and happy, but also, it's kind of hard. It is not easy to be fun and happy when things are mundane as they are right now. Like, uh, in in all honesty, <clears throat> episodes like this that are chill episodes are so much harder to record, in my opinion, because just there's. It's, it's inactive, right? There's not much going on. It's just, hey, we're going to fight this thing. And are you with me on fighting this thing or nah? Because it doesn't matter either way. Because, like, the 12v12 episode can't even be this episode. Um, we'll get to the 12v12, but the 12v12 won't be this episode. And so it's just like, eh. So I can... Oh, wait, I'm going the wrong way. Because, like, I mean, I guess the 12v12 could be in this episode. Things are progressing way faster than I thought they were, but it's just exposition is not not for the tired mind here. And I think I'm going to save the 12v12 anyways, because again, exposition and scary fights are not for the tired mind. Also, Shauna or Omega, how the frick did you teleport? Like, let's be honest. You did not j just climb the thing. Also, we're having like it intimate moment but also it's charizard so i don't really like it's like i don't understand why pokemon made this they even gave you the music of like an intimate moment and i'm like we're 10 year old children okay like no let's not be having intimate moments at 10 i guess technically we're a little older it's like 12 but still no absolutely not i haven't had one and i'm 22 and i'm okay with that it's fine But, like, they set this up. And that's just like, although, us playing it at night does make this this scene better. And it makes the scene make more sense. Be, I don't usually play this scene at night. So, I think this is one of the second time I've seen this scene played at night. Wow. That was so amazing. I would never want to forget this. So, I'll keep this in my heart. No. Thank you so much for finding Furfru. Oh, I almost forgot. Yeah, we gotta get the Poke Flute to wake up Snorlax at the middle of the night so that Snorlax actually makes us upset. You know, because it's not like we're waking him up in the middle of the day or anything. Here, here's the flute. Thanks for the flute. And the potential of two encounters. I do appreciate that. I want to make lots of memories. Oh, also... Mr. Butler, do you know anything about stupid Mega Evolutions? Okay, honestly, I like Mega Evolutions. I'm just giving it, I'm giving it flack. Oh, we got Trump Card. That's great. That's lovely. You know, it's fine. It's 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 okay. We'll get that as the tip. Honestly, that's it's a, not a bad move because it goes from like 40 to 80 to 120 to 1, 160 to 200 base power. So like the last three hit hard. It's just it's not. It, it, it's the build up and you can only use it five times right so like it truly isn't much that i it's like our tms have been pretty garbo not gonna lie trump card has been our best tm though so far so hopefully that trend continues and we continue getting better ones as the series progresses because if we do that then we'll be set up for a better future in this game because Honestly, that's where we're at, right? We could have a great game or we can just suck. And, like, we're still in that mid-stage of who knows what's going to happen. Because anything is possible. I know there's a TM there. I'll get it later. As I'm going to get it now. No, I said I'll get it later. Ah, no, we're going to eat now. 
I said we're getting it later. No, we're getting it now. I said we're gonna get it later. No, we're getting it now. Because it's literally right here. <laughs> like, it would be dumb of me not to get it now. Braviary. I, I'm happy that we got this. Okay, I, we can check out Braviary. I guess I guess that's what we... I figured out what we're doing the rest of this episode. Also, Buttpook has run away, so that's why he's Buttpook's in the front now. Is that a trainer? Is it... That is a... That's gotta be a trainer. I can't tell. I think it is a trainer, though. I want to say the TM is up top, so... Because they wouldn't put the TM, like, right there that easily. No way. Oh, yeah, that trainer just moved. Okay, it was, the, it was the trainer. Also, I swear if that wasn't even a TM. And I'm just freaking myself out that there's a TM somewhere when there's not. I'll be sad. An X speed. Again, that's stuff I can sell. Now that I'm getting not my, now that I'm not getting my money ripped from me, it is sellable. So it's not like it's a bad thing. I'm just awaiting. We haven't we have not had a shiny yet in Sogalog. There's a potential. I feel like we've been working towards it. Like it's going to happen. It's. I feel like it's on. Like if I go the like, let's think about this for a second. Again. If I go the entirety of Soglog without a shiny, like that will have me flabbergasted to the highest degree. Like and what? Even if I had a shiny though, what would I want? I guess is the question. Like I want something usable that I would actually like want to have on the team. I don't really... I can't think of one of those right now. Oh, there, yeah, okay. I was not wrong. That makes me feel better. I was like, I swear there is one. Kakuna. Kakuna is really silly. Okay. But I, I swear I'm missing a TM, I think. I probably am, honestly. But... but uh, uh, no! Oh, God. Okay. Oh, there's Cryagonal here too. Okay. Shiny Cryagonal would be funny, but I don't want a Shiny Cryagonal. Like, if I'm in a hunt somewhere, I want to hunt somewhere where I think that there can be a good chance of a good Shiny. Because uh, I'm really just thinking about that right now. Crafty Shield. Oh, that's a Shoop TM. That sucks. That's like really borderline. That's like. That's more than just bad. That's like really bad here's your flute sire oh my gosh we got the flute oh my gosh thanks you can you're the only one that can play it let's wake up this grumpy snorlax at 10 p.m yeah i think that's a great idea let's wake up the snorlax at 10 p.m yeah let's wake up the snorlax Everybody on three, wake up, Snorlax! <laughs> I don't know why I did that. Whatever. Is it? Yeah, it's, it's not randomized as normal, so it is considered a token if I do catch it. Which, presumably, I will, but you never know. It could be, it could be a bad situation. Pound. Ow. That did way more damage than it should have. For just a simple pound? Like, why is it doing 13? I guess we go into Angry Dino then. Because 13 damage is a lot of damage on a simple pound. And Angry Dino, Angry Dino has Intimidate as well. I also know it should live in Aerial Ace. Oh yeah, it lives too.
Uh, I'm actually not going to risk that. That, that could be a, the difference between a high roll and a low roll. So I should be able to hopefully try and great ball it and see where, where this goes. Because, yeah, that's, that's a high roll, low roll difference, which is a bit scary. Let's go, bad touch! You literally just glare them, and it's just that bad of a touch. That you, you, you glare them, and it just adds to suspicion and craziness. Bad touch is level 20! That's a bad touch. Brandy is level 20. Let's go. Everybody's getting to 20. This is good. This is, this is good. It is 6 foot 11, 1,100, or 1,014 pounds. We're going to name you T for token, which we're going to literally, we can use wherever, but we have to call. Honestly, no, let's just get it at about seven. You know what? You know what? We're going to get it at about seven. I do this, I basically do this every time, but like, we're going to get it on Route 7. We're going to get these next two encounters. We're going to see what's up, what's going on on this town, and end the episode off, honestly. And the next episode will take on Route 7. So, yeah. So, what we're going to do, then, is buy some more Pokeballs, because we need them. Can't the air... Just be, I mean, I don't think we have really much money. We didn't fight. We didn't fight a trainer. We shouldn't have money, actually. The way here is pointless. We don't have money. We have enough for one Pokeball. That's gonna help us so much. You don't even know how much that one Pokeball is gonna. That one Pokeball is gonna save our life. You know, that's just how this game works. No, it's not at all. But you know what? I'm trying to make any excuses I can to like make that look actually smart and big brain. But you know, there is no excuse for, for that. So. But I will go ahead and release our Pokemons. It has Moxie. Wow. So then it... But yeah, we're going to release it. Bye. You, you, you don't even... Like, you, you get to live in the universe. You know, it's fine. You're, you're going to do it. And I healed, right? I did. Okay. Bad touch. You're getting to the front of the party. Bad touch to the front. I mean, yeah. Sometimes there is bad touches in the front. But, you know, we can't really con control those. Unfortunately. Okay. So, I'm going to do the same thing. Like I said, I do this similar thing almost every time. Hi, Tierno. Hi, Trevor. Hi, Big Dumb J. This is the Pokemon Daycare. Come see it. I don't want to, though. Jonas, it's fine. I don't care. I, I truly don't. We we can... I get that we can put... Oh, there was literally a Pokemon Center right there. <laughs> I guess that... I could have done that. I got a Pokemon Center there. Also, you give me a TM, I think. Give me, give me a TM. Give me a TM. No. They do not give me a TM. Okay. So, what I'm going to do again, another thing I do in most of my... I'm going to get a t one in each grass. So, yellow grass... What, what are you going to provide me, yellow grass? Wow! Thanks for the worst Pokemon in the freaking game! Oh, ouch. That sucks. That's really bad. I say as it has a magic bounce and can... I mean, magic bounce is really the better and competitive, but... Like, that's, that is a good ability. I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'm not gonna sit here and say, oh, that's the worst ability ever. Ha ha ha. But, like, do I really want to waste my Pokeballs on a Pokemon that has the fluctuating thing it's got a fluctuating xp curve which is bad it's the worst and not only is that it's an illy meter like hmm. like i straight up do not know how to feel about that also continue raising my speed that's fine I 
because now it feeds back to normal. It's, it's it's really a, a case of the encounters, right? Because after this, we got Route 8. Or the cave in Route 8. There's two other encounters that I have to deal with after this. So it's not like this is it. I guess it is. Okay. So do I want to save my token for later? Hmm. No. I, I might as well get it now. Because this next fight is going to grant me four grand. You're going to get a meme name. I'm sorry. You're not going to be used. No, like... Huge abs. That's gonna be your name. You know? That's just gotta be. That just has to be your name. And we're gonna do the Pokemon uh, PC thing real quick to heal bad touches, organized boxes. Because if I do this. That's kind of busted, but... Cool. <laughs> that did what we needed it to do, so... I'm not complaining. Now, did it heal move? Did it literally, like, heal everything? That is the question. Oh my god, it actually did. <laughs> okay. That's, I, that, that's, that's cool. Game, if you want to do that, I'm not going to complain. Like, okay. I'm going to get my token in the purple grass. Do I want to hoard it? You know... No, I'm not going to. I don't trust it. Oh! You know, as a token encounter, that ain't bad. That is not bad at all. Glare still affects it. It's defensive. It's another pretty, really good Eevee light on. There's, there's the potential with this Pokemon. Steel and Ghost is a very, really, a very good typing. Two of my Pokemon actually can't touch it. I don't know how I want to play around with it though, because here here's my thought process. Yes, it's defensive. But what level does it evolve? That is also a question I need to answer. What level does Dual Blade evolve? Level 35. According to Bulbapedia, Bulba Garden. It evolves from Hone Edge starting at level 35 and evolves into Aegilash when exposed to a Dusk Stone. Oh no, it's another Dusk Stone? Oh, also, what did you just use? I just noticed I, your stats went up, and I also just noticed that I freaking killed you. Um, well, you were another Stone Evolution, that's your problem, Aegislash. You were just another Stone Evolution. Like, I can't have that. I fricked up. I got. It. I wasn't paying attention. I was too busy focusing on. Hey, what? When does the thing evolve? Ha ha ha! I don't think I would have used it. Like I like the Pokemon, but I really don't think I would have used it. So we're gonna like organize our boxes. We're gonna check on Risky. Inner focus. Holding a damp rock right now. I mean, at least you're holding a dust ball. I need that right now. 
So yeah, I think this is a good way to place to end the episode. I hope you guys had a wonderful one. I love you all. Bye.